Hello and welcome back to the channel, my name is Altschoy Galkoon and today I'm going to continue the playthrough of Yakwa Village Harvest Run. This is episode 6 and if you haven't seen the previous episodes, uh, the link will be at the top right of the screen. So in this particular run, I'm helping one of my friends uh, who um, to grow a rice farm and yeah, along with some other of his own friends. But anyway, um, and I hope I can get first in this one because um, I think this is one of the farms that uh, that I managed to max out if I'm not mistaken. Well, at least at, um, try to max it out to 5,000. Oh, is it 4,000 in the last episode? Yeah, I think so. So anyway, um, regardless of that, oh, what kind of number of uh, farms, uh, sorry, uh, rice that I collected throughout this entire episode. In, uh, and I hope that in this episode I will break that uh, 4,000 barrier to get uh, all the way to like 5,000 which the game will award you a very special prize but you can only get it look if that so anyway um, uh, th th there's not a particularly special but this one I guess um, It would be really funny if I actually got it first because um, my lemon cookies pad is not particularly at the same level, so I just missed uh, some of the cookie that uh, the bit pads that uh, was being tied. And you can actually release it by touching them, but I get most of them, but not like the ones at the bottom. But anyway, well, we have 20 seconds left, and oops, that's not particularly helpful. Anyway, we got the lemon skill, and this should be carry us through until the very end. Well, I mean, four. That's that's the first time ever. Can I get? Oh no, that's a bit too late. Yeah, but I think that yeah, the fir first time ever throughout this entire playthrough, I'm actually in last place. <laughs> But regardless of that, uh, my rice farm is at maximum level already, so I'm not too worried about that. What, but I do worry though is um, the persimmon one, which... Oh, I get it, so I don't need it anymore. I already reached the 4000 mark and we got the 1000 diamond as a prize. So yeah, that's very nice. More, get me more snacks. The snacks in the office storage have run out. What? An upset, unacceptable. I'm going to buy more. I know he enjoys snacks, but he has been acting strange lately. Huh? It's the magistrate. He never leaves his office. I wonder what his occasion is. A sweet scent is coming from the something. I think you smell the sweetness of our yakwa. Oh, looks delicious. I want them all. Here you go, sir. If you take a look at our village storage, you know how hard it is to store it still. Sure, this way sir, there are more snack stands over there here. I'm so full, what a lunch! Our village cookies always work, it's so hard morning and I, as I failed to narrate this thing and... <laughs> <laughs> but you know, this is the kind of the risk that um, I'm trying to do narration as um, a bit like later on when I did this kind of recording so anyway the story is basically for those who don't keep it up yet basically um, the, the new magistrate is coming to town and to enjoy um, the festival but unfortunately he just keeps eating a lot more and a lot more and like and uh, the and his assistant was just like um yeah he was act strangely because he usually eat this kind of yakwa but now he eats this another kind of yakwa and he just keeps eating in eating and basically like nobody noticed uh, that he acts strangely well at least like at the moment but unless there's only one cookie that kind of noticed and that is rebel cookie But, and now currently um, the the plot point is um, the oxygen magistrate is trying to recruit vagabond cookie into uh, his office so 
he can no longer like um, like, like celebrate it with the people and he can only like celebrate it and you have to like entertain the magistrate himself so yeah anyway we I'm already maxed out in terms of rice and corn farms but there's like one final reward which is the special pet which I can use to raise my pet level and oh and as, as I'm trying to be confused like what is going on oops daily bug upgrade 0.1 chance of locust appearing eating all of the eating the jellies in the screen okay that's pretty bad I, I, to be honest I have no idea why I, I managed to get this thing because like the you know you see like the game as I explained in the previous episode the game just gives random events that you cannot prevent it in ca any kind of way at least we have currently like the community have no idea how to sort of increase our luck to not having bad events like this but anyway if you if someone can figure it out then comment down below then uh, then the community will like really help uh, you will be thankful that you assist in this effort and speaking of effort uh, be sure to if you like this kind of content be sure to leave a like comment subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell so you won't miss out any videos that I put on this channel uh, there is no uh, charge in terms of um, you know it's like newspaper thing and you know when you subscribe and then you have to pay each month and, uh, no there's no there's no any kind of stuff everything is free so yeah I hope you also entertain be entertained in this video <laughs> So anyway, um, it's my own apple farm. Too bad that probably I won't get the most pack, um, maximum possible um, maximum the maximum possible apples. But hopefully, like this will inevitably help me to get five thousand, even. If that the effort will be slightly more. So anyway, uh, this is. I just want to inform that this is the second to last episode in terms of like the first part, because like this event itself is separated into two parts. Uh, the first part is this one uh, where you need to grow, uh, you know, um, apple, corn, rice, and persimmon. Uh, currently, I have no idea what the second event would look like, uh, but considering that the Death Sister actually uh, made quality of life change, like for example, they change uh, the length of which the uh, farm will harvest the fruits into like 12 from 12 24 hours to like 12 hours, and then they increase the ticket from 15 to 30 the third one is they they add two uh, brand new missions in day terms of daily where uh, you could get more uh, crystals which you definitely need for uh, leveling up your cookies and last but not least they uh, reduce the waiting time in terms of waiting for the tickets to arrive from 30 minutes to just 15 minutes and that's all the four changes that they made which um, the, the number three I think is the one that I haven't mentioned yet but yep that's pretty much it this uh, the all the changes they made in this uh, particular um, life change of life which definitely makes it better and makes it more um, more enjoyable even if the event itself yeah, is still pretty, pretty repetitive so I will not change the uh, my rating which is like 7 out of 10 and that's as, as I try to uh, remember what kind of um, apple seeds that's use, that is used on the uh, in the top 100 
in terms of little box but unfortunately i choose the middle one which is not what's not supposed to do which you're not supposed to do if you want to have the, the most maximum one you choose the right one but unfortunately also i made this mistake um i add the fertilizers and then they i immediately enter the um the v the mini game of just slides around to plant it and now i'm just reducing all the common fertilizers for more uh, chance to get uh, good bonuses and that's pretty much it for the video and this episode i'll see you on the final episode of this harvest run bye bye